2012, I was bankrupt, divorced, depressed, and literally watched my son move halfway across the country. And there was nothing I could do about it. But I'm so glad everything happened just like that because I found my true purpose in life. Fear is not real. Fear is a choice. There's no reason why you should be afraid of something that hasn't happened yet. If it hasn't happened yet, that means you still have time to keep it from happening. Don't take what you have for granted. You never know when life's gonna come calling. When it's your time to give up something. When it's your time for your number to be called. When it's your time to be stirred up from your comfortable position into an uncomfortable position. It doesn't mean you're a failure just because you failed. It just means you got some more lessons to learn. This is the life tuition that you have to pay to the University of Struggle. That's how I like to look at it. It's a cost you have to pay in order to get to a place that you haven't gone yet. So don't look at it as, woe is me. A lot of these people live in quiet desperation. I heard, uh, I heard excuse me, I read Henry, Thoreau, Henry David Thoreau. He said, a lot of men today live in quiet desperation. And I assume that those ladies too. But quiet desperation. That means that people will sit there and try to keep everything on the inside, not tell people about their experiences, not try to get help from their experiences, but they'll just sit there and rot. Sit at a low level and continue to just be miserable because they're in living in quiet desperation instead of trying to do something about their circumstances. Don't live in quiet desperation. I want the messages that I deliver and the music that I DJ to be a representation of what God has done for me in my life. His forgiveness and His mercy. I want people to know that there's a guy named Jesus that really loves us and wants us to make a difference in this world.